Coming off of three wins in four days, the UConn Huskies look to clinch their first series win in Big East play as they hosted the St. John's Red Storm at Elliott Ballpark. The Huskies were flashing the leather early as first baseman Ben Huber and right fielder Casey Dana made back-to-back -back diving plays to get Pat Gallagher out of the first inning unscathed. In the bottom of the inning, it was St. John's inability to make a diving play that gave UConn its first run, as Eric Stock hit a fly ball to right field just out of the reach of the diving defense and stormed around the bases for an inside-the-park home run. After the electricity of the first, it was small ball that got the Huskies on the board in the second, using two walks, two bunt singles, a stolen base, a sacrifice fly, and finally two more RBIs on an Eric Stock single, UConn extended their lead to four. A little uh, uh, death by a thousand paper cuts, you know, and the pitcher you know, has got to get off the mound, and then that's so frustrating, you know, now he got first and second, then we bunt again, now we got bases loaded. So it was a uh, mentally torturous inning for the pitcher. And the offense ultimately would score 13 runs, but at the end of the day, they only needed one as Pat Gallagher went to work on the Red Storm offense. Gallagher pounded the zone all day and relied on a solid defense behind him as he allowed only four hits while striking out seven Johnnies and walking only one. Our team just hit, hits the ball every single game and we give our, the pitchers a chance on the mound every single time. When we put up 13 runs, it gives us a lot of confidence to go out there, fill the zone up and attack anybody. So um, it was awesome, we played great defense. Um, that double play at the end was just a perfect bow tie to finish the game off of how well we just played. It was probably our best game all year. Yeah. The defense played until the very end as Gallagher got the ground ball to turn the game-ending double play, securing the complete game shutout as UConn beat St. John's 13 to nothing. The Huskies entered the season as the favorites to win the Big East, and they backed up those predictions today with an outstanding performance to start conference play, clinching the series with one game still to go. The Huskies will host the Red Storm again tomorrow at Elliott Ballpark, looking for the series sweep. Until then, I'm Ben Jansen, UCTV Sports.